Want AI in your pocket? Microsoft Copilot on mobile might be just what you need. In this video, I'll show you how to install it, use it, and unlock more features by signing in. You'll learn how to ask questions, create images, and even use your camera with AI, all from your phone. To install the free Microsoft Copilot app on your phone, go to the Play Store if you're using Android or the App Store if you're using iPhone. In the search bar, type Copilot and look for the result from Microsoft. The correct app has a colourful icon. Be careful not to download apps that look similar but are not from Microsoft. For example, something called Chatbot AI is not the real Copilot. It might even be unsafe. The official Copilot app is free. With the Copilot app, you can bring the power of AI with you wherever you go. Whether you're travelling, at work, or just relaxing at home, it can help with tasks, questions, and even creativity. Let me show you how powerful it is and some nice things you can do with it. Once the app is installed, tap Open. The first time you open the app, you'll see a message asking if Copilot can access your location. I choose Don't Allow, but you can allow it if you want the app to give location-based suggestions. After that, you can sign in but you can also use the app without signing in. To get the full experience, I suggest signing in. Tap the menu in the top left corner and then choose Sign In. You can use your Microsoft account or a work account. After signing in, the app unlocks more features. Now we can explore more advanced tools. The app is ready and you'll see a space where you can type your first question or command. Let's try a simple example. At the bottom, I'll type, what is the capital of Italy? Then I tap the send button. In just a second or two, Copilot replies and tells me the answer is Rome. It also gives the source, which might be Wikipedia or another trusted site. I can ask follow-up questions. By long pressing the response, you can see options to hear it out loud, share it, rate it as good or bad, or copy the text to use it elsewhere. Now let's try something more useful. I'll ask it to suggest three ways to start a conversation at a party for lawyers. I type that into the chat box and hit enter. Copilot suggests I talk about current events and law, personal projects, or my professional background. These are great ideas that make it easier to connect with others. Let's try some advanced features now. If you don't see the new conversation button at the bottom left, tap button in the top right and it will appear. Now let's try creating an image. I type Create a photograph of a chameleon. Then hit enter. Copilot starts generating a picture based on my words. This usually takes between 10 and 20 seconds. You'll see the image appear. Copilot might also suggest follow up ideas like adding a jungle background or changing the colors. When it's ready, I see picture of a chameleon. If I want to save it, I tap the download button the image and choose download. The picture is now saved to my phone's gallery. I can send it to friends, use it in a message, or post it online. Now let's look at another great feature. Copilot can use your phone's camera. Tap New Conversation again, then tap the plus icon at the bottom. You'll see two options, Upload a picture or Upload a file. Tap on Upload a picture and it will open the camera. You can also choose to upload from your gallery. The app will ask for permission to take pictures and record video. Allow it. Now I use the camera to take a photo of something around me. In this case, I take a photo of a shampoo and notebook. After the photo is taken, I write a prompt. I type. Describe the image in high detail and suggest how it can benefit me. Then I send it. Copilot analyzes the image and starts to describe it. This may take a few seconds. Even though I only took part of the notebook, it picks out details. It tells me about the shampoo bottle labelled Parachute Advanced Samporna, highlighting its benefits for strong, thick hair, and mentions the elegant notebook beneath it with its light blue cover and hexagonal pattern. This tool can be useful for many people. I know a carpenter who uses Copilot to document his work. He takes photos, asks Copilot to write descriptions and sends those to his customers. This app is powerful and can help in many different ways. 
Whether you're a student, professional, or just someone who loves technology, if you're using Copilot on mobile, you should also check out Poppy AI, which works beautifully across all devices. It gives you access to multiple premium AI models with more capabilities than Copilot alone. Watch my full tutorial on this channel to see how easy it is to use on any device.